Welcome back. Well, the Board of Water Supply is always having great workshops that help you out with your gardening skills, becoming a better gardener, and just having fun in general. Sherry McCombie, Community Relations Specialist from the Board of Water Supply, joins us this morning with all the details. Good morning, Good Sherry. Morning. Okay, so there's always great workshops for yes. you. Yes. The next month, though, February, yes. what do you guys have Full planned? of workshops. We have five in a row every wow. Saturday. Starts at 1030. You must be pre-registered. Uh, starting with February 1st, we have Rock Your Garden Workshop. Some people ask, what does that mean? Are you going to like put rocks in the garden? Well, we are, but they're going to be kind of uniquely special. You're oh, going to be please. able to create your own and then also learn the scientific scientific names of your plants. So you can even bring a picture or bring in a sample plant and then we can kind of paint it and then put the name and then you can add it to your garden. Cute! Yeah. And that can be a cute way too if you're wanting to like label things. Yes. Something like in even a if personal you do basil. Way, right? Look yes. how cute this is too. And you, got, you even have some... Uh, sequence on there too. Yeah, you know, I learned the hard way that you don't need a lot of glitter for it to be really special. So cute. Yeah. I'm trying to show off the painting <laughs> of this rock, but my nail paint is really bad. So <laughs> I'm going to back off from that, but it's so beautiful. And this one even has a cute little sparkle so right in the this center. This one I did, this one my daughter did. So if Love we can it. do it, anybody can do it. You don't need any experience. And, and is there an age limit? Who do you guys let? We huh. kind of target 10 and older okay. just because it'll be a little bit easier for right. parents to manage and they must be accompanied by an adult okay and of course adults as well right right okay yep. so that's the first one yes what else do you guys have uh, february 8th advanced aquaponics so we already have had a beginning one right this one you have your system uh you want to still raise your fish organic produce and safe outdoor water conservation mm -hmm. um, but you want some tips and tricks to make your system flourish so these are for for geared towards that. And okay. then even if you have a beginning knowledge and you just want to get some information, we welcome that too. Okay, perfect. Uh, then we have February 15th, the Rain Barrel Water Catchment Workshop. That one is always very popular and this being the only Saturday we're offering it until the summer, I think we're going to be quite busy. Definitely. Um, learn about the water catchment systems. They're going to go over important uh, installation uh, construction points, installation and maintenance techniques, mm -hmm. and then you go home with a 55-gallon barrel. Awesome. Okay, and again, this is the only one that you guys are going to be doing during this wet season. On so uh, yeah, on a Saturday. The next one will be in April on a Wednesday. Okay, correct. perfect. And then we have uh, February 22nd, how to make and use Bokashi compost. What's so that? it's a different kind of compost. Sometimes you can do a backyard bin, you need heat, you got to turn it. This one is done in a more manageable space, a smaller space. Uh, without bugs, heat, or smell. Oh, oh, very nice. So a little bit different anaerobic instead yeah. of aerobic. Uh, and then the last one is the painting in the garden workshop on Saturday, February 29th. Um, the second in the se uh, season, we have three this season. Erica Brown's going to do step-by-step -step instructions. This is also 10 and older, must be accompanied by adult, and there's always lots of adults. Perfect. Um, you will learn blending shading techniques. Yeah. She'll do it start to finish, and you'll be able to go home with 11 by 14 size plumeria, which is very drought tolerant. Nice. Yep. And then, of course, not only do you guys have great workshops, you also have your new free Xerox Seed of the Month, right? Yes, yeah, so we're doing a little sneak peek. We don't usually announce it till the first of the month, but you, got a preview. Yeah, you get a preview. So in February, we're doing the, um, let's see, the Adenium obesum, I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Okay. It's a desert rose. Ooh. So you see the pretty pink flower? Yeah. yeah. They um, are really xeric. You can tell that this one was probably grown from seed because the trunk, this codex, is kind of bigger and that's where it stores its water so you don't need to water it as often. Uh, these are offered Wednesday and Saturday from 9 to 3, one per household while supplies last. Yes. And so seed packets will be available. Um, they make a great house plant. Yes. Um, easy to care for. And they even kind of resemble like a little bonsai plant. Perfect, yes. And they look so cute. So again, if you want to head on out, Board of Water Supply, a lot of great workshops. They're free Xerox Seed. And for all the information on that, you can head to their website, which we'll link to on ours at k 2com Thank you so much Thank for joining you. us this morning, Sherry.